Remember like a couple weeks ago I made a video talking about like three trashy harem shows. My first girlfriend is a gal, which is really funny and you need to watch the dub because the dub is absolutely hilarious if you want to watch a... If you want to have a girl say 36 double D's nuts in it in an anime, yeah. Then uh, then there's Girlfriend Girlfriend, which is a, which is a harem show where like a guy is like, Why don't I just date all the girls instead of just four? Then we got Harem in the Labyrinth of Another World, which is just hentai and a hentai isekai. So this time, what if we took Girlfriend Girlfriend, the guy who has four girlfriends, but we multiply it by 25 times? I give you the 100 girlfriends who really, 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 really love you. Yes, this is an actual show or anime. So, uh, I do love being my harems. You can probably tell. So, uh, today we're talking about the 100 girlfriends who really love you. So, basically, I've decided to make one last anime video this year. Because, uh, one last review of an anime. And might as well just review, uh, I was considering reviewing Mother of the Goddess Dormitory, but I'll wait till next year to do that. Next month I'll do, uh, Mother of the Goddess Dormitory. Which is a really, really messed up show. Basically, it's like, what if we got a 12-year-old boy who lived with five college girls? That is an actual show. And, like, literally the best thing I could describe it as is the anime Why the Hell Are You Here, Teacher, mixed with The Loud House. That's the best way to describe that show. But, uh, yeah, let's get started on this time. So today we're talking about 100 Girlfriends, I mentioned that. So let's get started. There's this, the pink haired girl, uh, Hikari, I think that's her name. And uh, she's kind of horny, yeah. Then there's, uh, Kirhi, I, I, I don't know how to pronounce most of these characters' names, uh, uh, let's just say Kihari. Yeah, sure. Sure, I'll just call her that. She's the tsundere, but the ultimate tsundere. She beats up all the other guys. Then, we got the shy girl. I don't remember her name. Uh, then there's Nano AI, which is just a really smart girl who, like, is the top of her class. Then there is, uh, the lolly that can turn into a Pixar mom. <laughs> uh, then we got Hakari's mom. Her mom joins the harem. And, uh... The, in the latest episode I watched today, the main guy literally smashed the mom. Nice. Nice. He literally smashed the mom. And YouTube, I'm not talking about, like, the S-word smash. I'm talking about Super Smash Brothers Melee! Yeah, Super Smash Brothers Melee for the Nintendo GameCube. And yeah, so uh, this show does not take itself seriously. Just think of ghost stories, but it's made by an actual company studio in Japan and not just by some dubbing company. Like, literally, they refer to the swimsuit episode, the pool episode, as the swimsuit arc. The pool, the water park arc. Then, uh, there's literally a Breaking Bad reference. One person's like, you never know what it's like to try candy! Because in my channel, I refer to the Blue Rock stuff as candy on my channel. And he's like, you know what candy is? And she's like, I never know what it is like, but I am the one who knocks. Walter White made an appearance in this anime. And that's not the only thing. There's MLG air horns from like those 2015 MLG edits. And they even made Baldi from Baldi's Basics into the Vice Principal. I am not even joking. The Vice Principal's literally just Slender Man mixed with Baldi from Baldi's Basics. What even is this shit? What even is this anime? I do not know, but watch it, please. We need more. We need more 100 girlfriends. They're only at six girlfriends, and this guy is literally dedicating himself to put 100 girlfriends. Best anime of 2023. No doubt. That video of My Tiny Senpai I reviewed like a couple months ago. Absolute dog crap. Dog shit compared to this. <laughs> yeah. Dog shit compared to, uh, the 100 girlfriends. There's going to be a lot of reviews and stuff coming out next year because there's a lot of stuff I want to review next year, so yeah. 100 girlfriends. Watch it.